Yo, what is going on, everybody? It is Tristan. Got the camera a little bit more zoomed in today since, uh, well, I'm a little bit further back in my closet. But what we're going to be getting into is we're going to be discussing a few sneakers that I think are a good hold. I got them uh, right here by my feet. I'll just show y'all a couple of them uh, right now. You'll be able to tell what one of them is right off the bat. But yeah, some decent options. We'll get into discussing it. I'm also throwing in a bonus one. Basically, just letting you guys know some like some sneakers I see right now as being good hold opportunities until Christmas. I could see them, you know, maybe going for a higher price or getting a really, really good consignment sale around these times because people are going to be needing them for somebody or, you know, maybe just for themselves. I understand that. Gotta get yourself stuff. So yeah, we're going to get into it just all from there. Uh, make sure y'all uh, check out the Light Carbon SB review from yesterday. These are clean. These are clean. If anybody needs these, hit me on my Instagram down below. Don't forget, I'm always buying selling the trade in there so anybody needs any shoes just let me know check my story if you like anything hit me up i'll get you right but yeah these are dope i'm i'm i think i'm gonna keep these i don't know I haven't decided if anybody wants it it's a nine just let me know and don't forget to check us out down below at resale vision you guys can see we've been doing under market pairs of a lot of these recently the white thunder jordan force so if that's what you're into getting under market sneakers every single day we gave away a pair of chameleon sbs we're probably going to be giving away a pair of the verdi sbs as well so if that's something you guys are into you know giveaways getting under market sneakers and you know learning to source more we're gonna i'm gonna start getting back uh to doing the classes soon and there i've just been very very busy with starting college and getting in uh to my new apartment here so hopefully that all makes sense but again if you still want to get deals that's what we do every single day don't miss out on that and in there in there excuse me enjoying down below no wait list or anything you'll just get in right away and yeah feel free to subscribe and like for more content like this was trying to two or no 300 on this video i forgot we have the like goal i'm still i'm still adjusting to that but that's everything i need to say let's just get started so first one i kind of want to get into right off the bat is going to be the white thunder jordan 4 i would say in men's or grade school sizes this is a great option to buy right now until uh, Christmas. The main reason being is that, again, a lot of people are just letting these go low in price. But keep in mind, they didn't do like a million pairs of this Jordan 4 like some of the last few, right? I think people are letting these get a little bit cheaper than, you know, they honestly should be. They did about 150000 200000 uh, if you're going to include, you know, all the retail locations. And globally, probably a little bit more than that, I would say, because, you know, we got to think about all the other regions as well that got stock of these. But it wasn't like a massive release Jordan 4. And especially in the grade school sizes, these were not a super easy cop in GS sizes. So I just want to let you guys know that I think these in the grade school sizes are going to be making a lot of progress considering that parents are going to need them you know for their kids for christmas time or just for back to school it's a great sneaker uh considering you know it's that nice nubbuck material so you know somewhat water resistant um and just a good colorway overall like th this is just a you know a nice sneaker i could definitely see a parent you know buying these to you know get a matching pair you know so they have one their kid has one good little set you know what i mean but yeah i got a few of these i'm just going to be keeping them until christmas time because again if they're at 200 bucks right now where are they going to be in a few months you know what i mean like that i i think it's wild that these are reselling at those prices right now and it's like bro these just dropped it's like did, did we forget that or did nike really not do like any of the grade school ones so very interesting but i think we might see uh some crazy progress on the grade school sizes in the white thunders i think the men's ones will hit 300 eventually i mean the men the <laughs> you know what i mean the big sizes are already there after you know if you pay it like go through apps and buy a pair like yeah you're gonna be paying 300 bucks so i mean the big sizes are kind of already there but i mean they'll eventually get there like at the asking price 100 percent uh, just because, again, they didn't do like a million of these, and it's a very, very wearable colorway. You cannot go wrong with black and white. So for me, I got a, I got a lot of white thunder just because, again, I believe in the hold. I mean, if, shoot, if the yellow thunders, right, the re last ones I did in 2023, have a yellow and black shoe, which isn't necessarily super easy to wear. If those went up 50 to 100 bucks, and those are, you know, the, over $300 in most sizes, if not all sizes now, then... um yeah why could these not be you know arguably again as i mentioned in the last few videos a more wearable shoe but that's debatable and it honestly depends on uh you know just what you like to wear you know you may like the other thunders more you may like the red thunders more i mean again this is also the first one with that sb4 build people are forgetting man there's a lot of things about this shoe that make it uh a good hold in my opinion you know what i mean it just there's a lot of small details features and things about it like it just there wasn't a lot of grade school honest answer was not easy to cop gs you you see big people hitting big clips of the men's sizes on it like on instagram but i saw nobody with like huge bulk of these i saw one guy with huge bulk of these but i saw plenty of people with the thunders in men's size so let that that'll let that hopefully hopefully that tells you something hopefully that's good info but another one i want to get into just another grade school four i'm going to you know discuss really quick and hopefully i showed you guys uh the thunder four prices on the screen i mean i, could, I couldn't imagine that i would have edited edited that video through and not shown you guys the pricing i was kind of discussing 
probably did. But uh, this is the military blue grade school. Just want to quickly go over these. I think there's still a lot of potential left for these. They're currently floating around uh, 170 to 180 bucks, and around uh, like that back to school time, these actually were floating right around 200 dollars in size seven wine. Don't forget, these are a very wearable colorway. I know it's not everyone's style, but it has that SP4 build. And again, they didn't do a million of the GS ones. They did a million of the men's ones, but the GS ones, you know, they did brick and price. There was a point where you could buy these GS ones for like 120 to 140. Like there was discounts and sites, things like that. Like it was good when you could do that. Now you cannot do that anymore because back to school happened. Like you just have to think about times when people are buying sneakers and there's always a few times a year when people are looking for new shoes looking for new clothes stuff like that so you just got to think about that and it's like oh wait hold up i can just wait till then like you know what i mean just like just wait that's like the best advice i got with a lot of stuff that uh you may think is low in price right now but it's not going to last there forever people eat that up so that this is one of those ones i think will be across 200 dollars in most of the grade school sizes uh not within like the next like three to six months but maybe within the next year like 11 like when we're getting to like the 11th and 12th month maybe from the point i'm making this video today i think we could maybe see him at 200 bucks but uh it's gonna be a bit i think but Christmas could bring these to 200. I'm saying this also. Christmas could bring these to 200. dollars They could get pushed really quick to 200 dollars in seven Y, six and a half Y. Uh, but you know, five Y through like six Y and 4.5 Y, those ones are going to you know sit below 200 dollars for a while in my opinion. But six and a half Y and seven Y, those two sizes, I could see those crossing 200 dollars and standing across 200 dollars after Christmas time, just because you know so many people buy these up because it's a great. Uh, option for a kid, like affordable Jordan 4, good co classic colorway, can't go wrong. So just something I thought I would mention uh, about another grade school 4 recently. Now, why don't we get into something else? Uh, this is SB Dunk Low. Oh, this is actually not even the SB. Um, it's a massive buttercup. Look at the size of this buttercup. What, what size? 13? 13? This is not for sale. Sorry. I did not mean to show this. Uh, in the video that you can see this is just for my hold inventory because it's a hard pair to find but um the one i was going to discuss here's a picture of it on the screen that their skateboards sv dunk low i had a size uh well i actually have a size 13 their skateboards sv i just grabbed the wrong pair i don't know why is this the yeah everything's right i don't i just read the size tag wrong so yeah i mean I don't know why I did that, but aside from that, I think that their skateboards SVs are going to be a good hold. I just, I don't know why, um, you know, people let these get really cheap. Like they were at 150 or no, 140 to $150 in some sizes. And now I think they're actually back up to 170, 180 in most sizes. I could be wrong on that, but I did see some of those big sizes back at 175, 180. And I was like, hold up, these have made a little bit of progress. So, uh, even with as much hate as to their skateboards, SVs don't close their skateboards, SV dunk lows. I don't know why I can't speak. I think I'm just tired. Um, aside from that, I say that every video, but let's just continue. So I think people, again, are going back to the shoe, but it's also one of, I mean, it just dropped. So people aren't like going back to it to like be nostalgic, but I think people are kind of going back, picking it up now. They're like, you know what? I actually kind of like how these look, you know, the colorway is pretty good. Like seems like a wearable shoe. Good for fall. I'm gonna go cop my pair. And I think that's what's happening with the their skateboards sb but also it's just a, it's a big size sb all you have all you have to do is wait all you have to do, it's it is the easiest thing in the world like that's why i have a lot of you know shoes just like this kind of random ones uh because all you have to do is wait man they're hard shoes to find it's not like you just come across them like that and you're like oh that was easy to find no 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 no. it's not very easy to find those big sizes so it's just one of those things i want you guys to pay attention to uh all it is is a waiting game with sps it's very very easy it's not very hard because sp has a niche community kind of like jordan fours where people will come back to them it, you know they'll, they'll almost always go up in price because they have so many people that want the shoes like you know what i mean if they stopped doing jordan fours for a bit and then they came back to them five five years from now they would still be flipping i could bet on that but just because people like them just because people like them they're great shoes but also just because um what was i gonna say again the community of people that literally just collect jordan fours people that just collect sps trust me there's people that do that so i mean that's that's you know they're always going to be supporting the model you just have to think you know kind of like that and you're like oh wait hold up these are always going to be good i just i just have to wait that's it unless it's like a, a shoe with like a just absurd amount of stock then just get get it off and think about another uh you know pair you can grab maybe but if it's something like again the military blues breads powerpuff sbs big size and you got a big size something like that bro just wait good pair best advice i have those are a few i did say i was going to mention a bonus option so let me do that so this is one that i hadn't mentioned too much in recent videos but 
I'll pop it up on the screen. So as you guys can see, the Paris Jordan 4, or wet cement Jordan 4, excuse me, uh, in grade school sizes is reselling pretty good. At least last time I checked, it was at like 170, 180. I don't know if that's moved too much. Uh, but I just want to let you guys know, I think this is going to be another very good hold. It has that SB4 build. The Paris 4s are really nice. I love them. Like, you know what I mean? Just a very comfortable, nice, easy to wear gray sneaker. Look at how most gray shoes are done over time that do not restock. These aren't going to be restocked a million times. Most of the restocks are done. You may see a small like Shopify one, but those get eaten up by bots. No manual user is copping those at the moment. Um, I mean, there's been like, I think there was like one larger restock recently in Hibbit, but that was pretty much it. Um, so like the, the restocks are, you know, pretty much done and they will be done. Uh, well, if they, if they aren't, they're going to be. That's what I'm saying. But I do think that, again, I haven't seen really many restocks for the GS sizes. And it was all, already a pair that was pretty hard to cop in the grade school sizes. You know what I mean? The men's ones were easier to cop than GS ones. Same thing we have with the White Thunders. I just think we're going to see a lot of progress with some of these GS4s that are getting slept on right now. Because Nike did do a lot of pairs of the men's sizes. But the GS ones... They weren't like, you know, loading the boat like that. The only one that really loaded the boat like that with GS pairs was a military blue grade school. But with White Thunder GS and with um Paris 4 grade school, neither of those had like a you know, massive amount of stock. I don't I think I just heard my ice machine or something. We're in the apartment right now. I don't know why that's going off. But um make it nice, I guess. But yeah, that's what I can say. A few shoes I think are good holds right now until Christmas time. Honestly, like I see these making progress in December. So if they don't make any progress until then. Uh, it's because they're going to be making progress in that month. So just make sure you guys understand that right there. But a few of these, I feel like we'll continue to make progress. White Thunder grade school, military blue, military blue grade school. Feel very, very comfortable about. Uh, and also the, um, I mean, any, almost any big size SB, like just go look at mo even some of the GR SBs, ones that have been near retail price or at retail price, under retail price. Go look at what some of those ones that were at those prices a year ago and look at what they go for now. City of Love SBs are reselling for like 200 bucks in big sizes. Those were huge bricks. You know what I mean? It's just big size SBs, it's a waiting game. I try and tell this to people, you know, some listen, some don't. That's all it is. Regardless, I appreciate anyone that tunes in. So that's everything I really need to say. Again, if y'all want more content like this, feel free to subscribe and like down below, man. Just trying to 300 likes on this video. That's a new goal. And again, if y'all need any kicks, let me know on my Instagram. This is really the, the shoe I can get access to right now. So if y'all need these, let me know. Just hit me on my Insta. I'm getting back to DMs tonight. Um, and if you don't need these, just check what I got in my store. I got a lot of stuff for sale. If you're looking for a certain pair, just hit me up. I'll, I will get back to you. And if I hadn't gotten back to you, uh, just shoot me another message. I, I honestly probably missed it. Like I do miss messages sometimes. I do not intend for that. But check us out down below at Resale Vision. Also, don't forget, we do under market sneakers every day. Uh, we're going to probably be giving away a pair of Verdes. I mean, a lot of y'all have been supporting. So I feel like it'll probably be only right to do that once we, again, get closer to release date. The market settles a little bit more just so I can kind of see, uh, you know, what size will be given away. Because that's not going to be one of those giveaways where I can just be like, oh, we'll give away up to size 14. Because size 14 is probably going to go for like, I don't know, like a grand and a half. So I'm not even, I cannot do that. I cannot afford it. <laughs> that's the, I'll tell you the honest truth. But an eight or nine or seven or a 10, 11, I can probably afford to give away that. No problem. But yeah, the, you, you see what I'm like, just go look at what born and raised SBs go for in size 14. I'm pretty sure it's like a couple grand. Could be wrong. Just for those have never been cheap for reference. Maybe I could throw a bit out. We'll see. But that, that, that's it. Again, check us out down below if you want deals every day. We've been doing a bunch of the white thunders. I mean, hopefully I showed you guys some on the screen and uh, yeah, I mean, again, that's what we do every single day. It's just bringing you the best stuff that you want for under market prices. So you can flip it, keep it for your collection. That's it. So I've been talking for a while here. Let's see, 14 minutes. All right, some of this was, you know, breaks though. So that's a good thing. It won't be too much talking, but I'm yapping now. So I'm T, thank you guys. I'm gonna catch y'all in the next video tomorrow. Don't miss out on that. Uh, I'll think of some topic, probably on the birdies, maybe a how to cop for that since I'm starting to get more release info. So we'll see. It'll be a good video though. I'll see y'all tomorrow. Peace. Empty your mind. Be formless, shapeless, like water. Now you put water into a cup, it becomes the cup. You put water into a bottle, it becomes the bottle. You put it in a teapot, it becomes...